Milan has one of the best public transport services in Europe. There are around 80 bus lines, 17 tram lines, and 5 full service lines of the Metropolitana subway. Last year, I made a video on everything you need to know about Milan's public transport tickets. And this time, it will be the 2023 update. The common name of Milan's transport ticket is called the ATM ticket. ATM is the company that runs all sorts of public transport in Milan, which include metro subway, bus, and trams. Then come to the most asked questions. The ATM ticket, is it only for the Metropolitana subway? Or can I use this also to take bus and tram? Well, the answer is yes, you can use the ATM ticket for all modes of public transport in Milan. You can use it obviously for the Metropolitana subway, bus, and also trams. Now let's get started with the updates. First, there's a new price. The ordinary ticket price has gone up from previously a 2 euro to 2 euro and 20 cents for this year. Every ATM ticket includes the area from Mi 1 to Mi 3. and covers almost all stops in Metropolitan subway lines. With the exception of the last 8 stops on the M2 Green Line from Cernusco to Gesate. On M1 Red Line, the Rofiera Exhibition Center is now within the coverage area. The coverage also includes the new M4 blue lines connecting Linate Airport with the new station right in the city center. And we will talk more about this on the next coming video. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and set the notification bell on. Now the second update. Card payment is now available also on bus and tram. Before, you can always use your bank card payment as well as Apple Pay and Google Pay to enter the Metropolitan subway. Now, on board of bus and tram, you can also find the bank card reader payment system. It is easier and more convenient than getting your ATM tickets from the machine. Simply tap your bank card or any online payment you have connected to your device as you board the bus or tram. Just like using any conventional paper tickets or online ticket from the mobile app, which I will talk more about it later, this method of payment also gives you a 90 minutes of validation time. For this, you will need to always tap on the same card or payment account every time you change to any mode of transport during the 90 minutes of validation time. Okay, next to the third update. There's a new city center stop for the M4 Metropolitana subway line. Now, Metropolitana M4 subway line connects you directly between Milan Linate Airport to San Babila. Practically within walking distance of the Duomo Cathedral in Milan. And we can use the ordinary ticket, the 2 euro and 20 cents ticket, to take this M4 Metropolitana subway line. 
make sure you are subscribed to this channel as for the next video we will see how fast and easy you can travel between Linate Airport and Duomo Cathedral by taking the new M4 Blue Line Metropolitana subway. Anything else regarding buying and using the transportation ticket in Milan remains the same. Milan's public transportation system is very easy to use and here is some information that is useful to know. On how to buy the tickets. You can always buy tickets from the machine on every Metropolitana subway station. Look for the M signs. Make your way down to the stations. There you will find the ticket machines near the entrance gate. Tap the screen to wake the machine. Choose your preferred language. Then select your ticket. An ordinary ticket that costs 2 euro and 20 cents and it is valid for 90 minutes for multiple trips. Next is daily ticket, cost 7 euro and 60 cents. Then the 3 days ticket that cost 13 euros. It is valid for 3 days in consecutive. You can pay for the ticket either with cash or using your card. Now you have the ATM ticket, you have all the access to use all modes of public transportation in Milan. To start your journey, you will need to validate the ATM ticket. If you are taking the subway, then by entering the Metropolitana gate, you automatically validated your ticket and the validation time start. If you are taking a bus or a tram, look for this orange box, then slide in your ATM ticket to be validated and as well the start of your validation time. Remember to always keep your ticket during its validation time. If there is an inspection, a failure to show your ticket can lead to a hefty 50 euro fine or even more. And each ticket can only be used by one person. Another option is to download the ATM Milano mobile app. You can skip the effort of going to the ticket machine simply by buying your ticket using the mobile app. Ticket options in the ATM Milano mobile app are rather limited. There are the ordinary ticket, 24-hour ticket, and 10 trips carnet ticket. There are options for payment you can link with this app, including payment with PayPal. Once you bought the tickets, they will be stored here at the tickets button, and it functions as your ticket wallet. To start using your ticket from the mobile app, you will have to validate it by yourself. Simply by tapping the validate, then you will have the validation time displayed. As well, you will have the QR code that will be needed to enter the Metropolitana subway. If there is any inspection, you just need to show this to prove that you have a valid ticket. Not only for buying tickets, the ATM Milano mobile app is also pretty much packed with lots of useful features. The map function is where you can search for destination and see which mode of transport you could choose. The map interface is uh, very familiar as it is using Google map interface. Everything is straightforward, easy to use. 
Then you have the full list of tram lines and bus lines, complete with map route and every single stop. I will leave a link in the description for you to find and download the ATM Milano mobile app on your smart device. I hope this video shares some useful information about how to buy ATM tickets in Milan and hopefully you can take the best advantage of Milan's public transportation system. More videos on how to, guides, casual walks, and other trips are coming on this channel. Make sure you are subscribed, turn the notification bell on, and help sharing the video from this channel. Again, thank you so much. I could not have done this without the support of all of you nice people out there. So, I will see you on the next video. Ciao!